Satellite images of the Colorado River provided by NASA show the powerful rush of water out of Glen Canyon Dam in late April moved sand down the river mission accomplished. The U.S. Bureau of Reclamation opened up the flow down the Colorado River and downstream to Lake Mead on April 24, sending a gush of water at 39,500 cubic feet per second and lasting 72 hours. The desired effect, push sand and sediment out of the riverbed below the dam to build up sandbars further down the river. Those sandbars provide camping spots for people along the river. The image slider below shows the result, particularly in the area around Horseshoe Bend, one of the most photographed spots on the Colorado River. In the afterimage, the burst of water coming out of Lake Powell is still visible as a white splotch just below Glen Canyon Dam. Since this high flow experiment, releases from Lake Powell have dropped to a range from 14,000 CFS to 19,000 CFS, depending on the time of day and the day of the week. Flows are generally higher in the afternoons and evenings, according to the Bureau of Reclamation.